Welcome to the Easy Computer Fixes channel and today I want to show you how to remove the Ask Toolbar. Ask Toolbar is a very very popular toolbar not because people want it because there's a lot of software that you download that actually wants to install this toolbar and it changes your search provider to Ask which is really really an honorable search provider. Now a lot of people have it um, and I would say that probably um, in 10 clients that I have that have all these toolbars installed, out of 10, at least half of them have the Ask toolbar. Um, it comes from different sources. It can be from a Java update if you have Java installed on your computer. And by the way, if you don't use Java, you should remove it. Java is a nuisance and has been used a lot by pirates to actually infect computers. So. Um, if you don't need Java, don't uh, or don't install it, first of all. And second of all, if you have it installed, go and uninstall Java. You don't need that in general. Um, so how do you remove it? First of all, you'll go into your control panel. So go into your start and go into control panel. And there you will have programs and features. If you have the categories view, you should see programs and click on install a program. If you have the icons view, then you will have the programs and features that you can click on. Here you'll see a list of all the software installed on your computer. Look and search for Ask Toolbar. Here you can see it. I have it right here, the Ask Toolbar. And uh, I intentionally installed it so that I can show you how to install it. So you click here, Ask Toolbar, and you click Uninstall. That is the first thing that you want to do. You say yes to pretty much everything. It says here that it's going to uh, uninstall, but I need to close my browser. So I'll close my browser here because this is where it is right now. Retry. Retry again, and we go. So make sure your browsers are closed once it is closed. Your browser should have normally come back to its default settings. Uh, that's in Explorer, Firefox, or Chrome. So to make sure that you are in the default settings, what you'll need to do is um, if you are in Internet Explorer, for example, go check that you may be on Google Chrome. If you're um, not, or if it still says ask you can of course go into your internet options and put the your favorite web page or start page here in that little box at the top. You can also click that uh, little uh, tools and uh, go into manage add-ons and there you will check for ask toolbars uh, information here and disable everything and you can click search providers make sure that you are not using um, ask so um, these are little things to check but usually when we remove ask it is pretty much um, gone if you are in Firefox or in Chrome same thing you'll go into the options on the upper right and you will uh, check for the uh, toolbar in the uh, extensions if you see the toolbar in the extensions, you will um, remove it by just clicking the uh, little trash can at the uh, extreme right of that uh, toolbar. And that's pretty much how you remove the Ask toolbar. Things should be back to normal. Uh, one word of caution, a lot of people that have the Ask toolbar actually have many, many other toolbars. I do suggest that when you are using such a piece of software to go and get malwarebytes.org website, go and download this excellent free piece of software to remove malware from your computer. Click the free download, free version download. When you install it, it's going to ask you, do you want to activate the free trial? Just remove the little check mark and so that you'll have only the free download and uh, basically 
just start your malware bytes and scan for all of that. Malwarebytes is a great piece of software to remove anything that's unwanted. So uh, that's pretty much what you'll have. Everything that Malwarebytes finds, just put in quarantine and um, hopefully everything will be back to normal. Uh, just make sure that you remove it right. If you have any comments or questions on what you've seen, let us know. Maybe you have a toolbar or some problem with something on the web. Let us know. We'll try to uh, create that little um, video that will explain how to remove uh, such toolbars and such bad stuff from your computer. If you have any comments or questions on what you've seen, let us know. Maybe you have a uh, feature. Let us know also. Or try to put that video. Maybe something you don't understand that you'd like to have uh, really, um, really to know more. So thank you for watching and hope to see you again on the Easy Computer Fixes channel. Bye-bye.